Hot Chuck looks at a movie. The Longest Yard is a remake of the 1974 film of the same name starring Burt Reynolds, both of which are about a football game in prison between the inmates and the guards. And if ever there was a reason not to remake a good film, this is it. Unless, of course, this remake starring Adam Sandler in the Burt Reynolds role, yes, Adam Sandler, is actually a remake of the 2001 British remake called Mean Machine, which is about a soccer game in prison instead of football. I can't make the same remakes comment about Mean Machine because I've never seen it, much less heard of it, but the Mean Machine is what the 1974 film was called in Great Britain, and what we call soccer is called football there. Get it? Me neither. At any rate, if you can imagine Adam Sandler in any Burt Reynolds role, maybe you can imagine him as a professional football player, American style, who goes to prison in Texas where we are told they take two things very seriously, prisons and football. Sandler plays Paul Crewe, but I can't think of him as playing an actual character in any film, only as Adam Sandler. Anyway, Sandler goes to prison after a silly car chase following an obligatory party scene at the beginning of the film, and he tells the warden, I just want to do my time here and go home, nothing else. However, the warden, played by James Cromwell in another in a long line of bad guy roles, which is getting old, has plans to run for governor and wants some name recognition exposure. The prison guards have a football team, and so the warden talks Sandler into putting together a team of inmates in order to play the guards in a tune-up game. Talks is such a nice word, let's just say he blackmailed Sandler into doing it. And so we have a series of set pieces while Sandler recruits football players from the inmates, all with the help of a prisoner called Caretaker, who's played by Chris Rock. Burt Reynolds himself even shows up to help coach the team, and there are some real professional football players and wrestlers in the film, too. The Longest Yard is just a lame excuse for Sandler to show off. I'm Dan Culverson, and this is Hot Shot.